Hello everyone and welcome back to Car Conversations. Today I'm going to show you how to install floor mats in the 2023 Acura MDX Advance. So we recently uh, got all of their floor mats for this car. Um, right now they're carpets, but usually the all weathers cover the carpet mats. So I'm gonna walk you through how to put these in. So since this is a seven passenger vehicle, you've got two seats in the front, three seats in the second row, and two seats in the third row. You may be wondering about this piece right here. So it actually has a removable middle seat. So if you remove that seat, you can actually put that there. So let me show you how to first put in the driver's floor mat. You can actually see um, the driver's floor mat is very much different from the passenger floor mat because uh, the driver's side has the pedals, so you have that little piece there, but the passenger side does not have any pedals. So we will install these right now. All right, so to prove that we do actually have the carpet floor mats, we're just gonna lift up the all-weather floor mats. So this is the driver's side one. You do kind of have a, a very stylish MDX badge there. So let's bring it around here. And then we'll install it just by laying out, laying it out right here. All right, so it should line up with those little anchors right there and then you push it down and then you just um, turn it so it is vertical. All right, and there we go. Driver's floor mat is installed. Now for the passenger side. Okay, so let's move this little charger out of the way. All right, so looks uh, kind of lined up. You've got to make sure it's lined up with the little anchors there. All right, so you've got one anchor in like that, and then there's the other one. So um, passenger side floor mat, check. And we can put the um, charger back. Now let's try the second row floor mat. This one's probably going to be a little bit trickier. Oh, walk away out of lock. It's just activated. All right, so let's grab the handle to unlock. See my smart key demonstration for all of that. But let's see. Got to put this side in first. Yeah, this is going to be pretty challenging, so I might have to cut some parts out. Alright, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go to the uh, rear driver's side because it's just too challenging for, to do it from that side. I did get that side in, and here's the removable little seat, by the way. Okay, so I can't really... F okay, I think I see the anchor... And then I guess I have to push it down a little bit more. And then there we go. Now for the third row. All right, let's walk away out of walk. It's pretty sensitive. All right, to get into the third row, there's a little button down here. But I'm just going to use the one here. All right, so I took up the carpet floor mats. And yeah, before you put in the floor mats for this, you should probably vacuum it up. All right, 
I don't know if I'm gonna have to go on the uh, other side again. I really hope not. All right, so let's just tuck that under there. And yeah, there we go. So third row floor mats are in place. Now for the cargo array. So let's see if the kick sensor will work. All right, so it did work. Now I'm gonna get out the folding cargo tray. This is the long one. So you see it doesn't exactly fit uh, without it being folded. I actually have to fold it up for it to actually fit. I don't know if I did that right. But see it kind of fits. But it would fit even better if the um, third row is folded down. All right, third row is down. Let's unfold that. Okay, let's see if I can do this. And also, you may not need it for just this um, part behind the third row because you can actually um, flip up the false bottom floor and then you can make it a carpet side or a plastic side, hard plastic. So, yeah, both. Oh, well, the carpet's not very easy to clean. This side is a lot easier to clean than the carpet. So, maybe you can use this instead. So, let's get this in. So, you've got little indents here. So you can get access to your tow hooks and all. So okay, a little bit stuck on the seat belt. Alright, so let's move our umbrella out of the way. And then cargo mat is in place. And then we'll use the walk on close to close it. Alright. So we've got all of the floor mats out, except for this one. We don't really need the middle seat removed. But thanks everyone for joining me today on this brief video of the 2023 Acura MGX. I hope it was helpful, I really do. And as always, hit that like button and subscribe.